Yes, welcome back to another vlog. This vlog is a mess all over the place. I debated uploading this, but I'm like, you know what? It's okay. I'll do it. It's fine. Um, anyways, this is the last vlog that I have until I start Vlogmas. Yes, the rumors are true I'm doing Vlogmas this year, but I'm not gonna be uploading every day. Instead, I'm gonna be filming every day all week and then uploading it every Monday. So starting Monday, December 7th, and every Monday in December, even though it's only four Mondays, right? Me e claws. Yeah, so it'll just be a vlog of the whole week uploaded into one video four times this month. Enjoy the remaining vlog footage that I have until we start getting into Christmas content. Thank you for watching. I love you all and enjoy the video. Pa. Oh, hello. So I look crazy. I just got out of the shower. Welcome back to a vlog. I thought I would vlog today. This week is Thanksgiving week. Um, mixed, mixed emotions, mixed feelings. Grew up loving Thanksgiving, loving the idea of Thanksgiving. Growing up more, realizing, oh, this is what Thanksgiving is. This is not good. But <laughs> cold coffee, yum. Because my family celebrates it, I thought, you know what? There's really nothing I can do if my family celebrates it besides educating them, so here we are. I'm doing a bulk of the cooking because I love cooking and my family has a gorgeous kitchen. The kitchen in our old house was just really small. I like bald. <laughs> So yesterday was Monday. Um, what did I do yesterday? I'll recap. I uploaded a video. I made chicken stock for the first time by myself and it was such a success. And then out of the chicken stock, I made chicken salad. And that's about all I did. Then I took like a fat two hour nap because I was so fucking exhausted. My dad does that every single day for, tw for like the last 40 years. He's just on his feet all day long. Like girl, could not be me. Just got to update that. Once again, Joe Biden won Pennsylvania. Yeah, we know. First things first, I have to film a video for Thursday. When I don't wash my hair before filming, it is so abundantly clear how disgusting it is. I have to make cornbread and let it sit out for two days and get really like crunchy. <laughs> Basically, I'm making stuffing Corn, cornbread stuffing. I'm making cornbread stuffing. So we gotta make the cornbread. Let's get to it. Hi, I'm back. So since we last talked, what happened? What happened? What happened? What happened? My dinner, my dinner, my dinner, my dinner. Filmed a video, made cornbread. You guys, I was filming my video. I got my results from my 23andMe and I thought I would open them on camera. I've been waiting hours. Okay, so as you guys know, let me tell you my little story. As you guys know, I look very ethically ambiguous. I could be Italian, I could be Latina, I could be Middle East or anything. So growing up, I always felt sort of just like all over the place. Like obviously I'm Lebanese and Greek and it, it's like when, when I say that it like clicks for people, but I grew up with people sort of telling me my identity. I'll be like, oh, I'm Lebanese and Greek. Oh, but you don't look like it. And also bullying for being hairy. You know, having just like very pronounced features. <laughs> I went to school post 9-11, so it was a lot of terrorist jokes, but... Okay, here we go. Oh, okay. Okay, this is... This is literally everything I already knew. <laughs> I am 86.1% Western, Asian, and North African, so it says Arab, Egyptian, and Levit... Levit... Levantin? Bitch. <laughs> the Levant, com oh, compromise of modern day Lebanon, Syria, Jordan, Israel, Palestine. Okay, so what I need, what I knew. And then I am 13.81% European, so Greek and Balkan. So this is literally everything I already knew. Like I'm not really in tune with my Greek side, barely my Lebanese side, honestly, but very much not my Greek side. The Balkan Peninsula is nestle nestled in the southeastern corner of Europe and serves as the geographical. The what? So yeah. <laughs> Let me see if I have any relatives. Watch me have a sister or a brother. I have never heard of Levantian. Levantin? Girl, you know I'm mispronouncing that. All right, so now I have to get editing, a little bit of editing done. Um, I'm trying to take Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday off for Thanksgiving, but who knows if that's gonna happen. I like work every single day, but. This is a song I like to call The Grind Never Stops For Me and Me Only.
The grind never stops for me and me only. Hello, my name is Kaylee and welcome to my Thanksgiving week recap. Let's get started. So to start the week off, my mom and I tackled our basement. My parents haven't touched this basement since they moved and we needed to find all of our Christmas decor. So we just unloaded boxes upon boxes upon boxes and oh, look at her, stunning. Then with all the Christmas decor we found, I created a little island. <laughs> also, why did anyone tell me this is what I look like from the behind? Why do I look like why do I look like a, a middle school counselor bending over? Oh my, you know what I look like? I look like a teacher bending over to help somebody with their work. This is unacceptable. Oh my god. All I want for Christmas is to not look like this. Thank you. On my parents' countertop, it was so cute. It was so cute. Then we went through the 30 boxes of Christmas ornaments. And then that night I decided to bake cookies, but I didn't thaw the butter before. So it just went error. And then later that night I made cranberry sauce because it is elite and so yummy. And I made a pie. Not the cutest, the crust, just what? That, uh, uh, we won't talk about it. Then the next day was Thanksgiving day and I had to make my collard green and my stuffing. Um, So I needed to check that bread density. Oh, very hard. And then our refrigerator started to fucking freak out. The water and ice maker decided to go ham for some reason. We have no idea what was going on. And boom, bitch, that is my Thanksgiving meal. She was elite. She was beautiful. The turkey was a little raw, but that's okay. And that was my Thanksgiving recap. Hello. Hello, I'm on my way to get a Christmas. Why do I look like that? We get a real tree every year. I think we started getting a real tree when we were adults. Like I can kind of understand how like getting a real tree with two kids can be really overwhelming. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> Hello, I'm sweating like a goddamn bitch. Woo, got the tree. <laughs> Actually, it wasn't as crowded as I thought it was gonna be. And now I'm waiting in line to get it. It was a Fraser Fern, thank you. Um, yes, I don't know. I don't know, I don't know the difference. A tree is a tree, a love is a love, and life is a life. And that's all I have to say now. Um, but yeah, I got the tree successfully, hopefully. Period. Um, uh, now I'm waiting in this long line of cars to get the tree. Happy Saturday, love, and goodbye. Yeah! Why do from this angle I look like a philosopher? I look like a male philo- You know those men who have long hair and glasses like these and then like study like the ocean for a living? That's literally what I look like right now. I look like I'm about to go get lost at sea. Anyways, okay. This is the tree. It's on my car. I don't know. I'm th rethinking these glasses, to be quite honest. <laughs> it's kind of tiny, but we don't really need a big tree. So I'm about to get it down. You about to watch. Sorry for all the random blurring. I don't want to expose where I live, but uh, here's me getting the tree down completely by myself. Oh, God. Look at that face. Oh, God. Here we go. Yes, bitch. CrossFit taught me well. Y'all, I found a... <laughs> I found a recipe online <laughs> that was like, take all of your Thanksgiving leftovers and make a casserole, and bitch, I did. Here we are. So we have my casserole, and the first thing I noticed that it is very wet. Wet. I made gravy. <laughs> Ooh, okay. That's about enough. Let's let's try it. I guess I'll get all the. It literally looks like slop. I feel like I am eating baby food. That's okay. Okay. That is okay. Um, thank you for thank you for coming with me on this journey. It is very wet. Very wet time. I just got an email from a YouTuber, and I will never tell you who it is. But oh my god! I specifically specifically talked about how I didn't want to take any on any more clients. I would be an idiot. I would be a fool. <sighs> okay, it's it's 12:30 and I don't want to scream, but Okay, I had to just get that out. Okay. I'm going to <sighs> 
all I gotta say is December is gonna kick my ass. I'm a mother. No drama. <laughs> I'm a mother.